build a product uh, to, be, to make a um, very uh, I want to build a product that... And, and you pitch it to all of these guys as well, not only me. Uh, look, look at these, there's a room full of investors here. So you want to make it harder, right? Okay. No, 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 easier. These guys are all going to pull, open their wallets later on and, and invest in you. So. <laughs> okay, so uh, I want to build a product that uh, will, uh, uh, search, uh, will be composed of uh, entertainment and games that would really matter for your kids and for, uh, for you as a parent. Maybe even, even for the other people uh, as a strategy for... Uh, uh, okay, so a uh, huge growing market, so I want, I want to add a single creative solution. Um, there is competition in all areas covered by the product, but uh, none of them combines everything very creatively. Um, crowdsourcing platform, which will be simple at the beginning, very simple. I'm already uh, already designed that. Uh, selling revenue model subscription item uh, item purchase, in app purchase and uh, also uh, payment services like uh, you have a profile for your kid, uh, you see what uh, uh, what problems could they have. Um, I made some custom development to kids and parents only for the for problem at the beginning and also a little bit of uh, research. Uh, actually a research. Uh, some things used uh, in startup, my mind, my child, my wife, my Big pivoting uh, possibilities in case uh, I don't know why it should work, but in case it doesn't, it happens sometimes. Um, so, safety improved emotional and cognitive intelligence. I would, uh, actually, I'm going to, to try to improve, uh, try, I'm going to improve uh, emotional intelligence. And through that, uh, there is a link to, to, to intelligence. I've done a lot of research, I've talked a lot of psychologists, with some neurologists, uh, some uh, people in the uh, personal development, and uh, I think I have a way that uh, could be better. Uh, okay, uh, some videos about content, children's stories, jokes, certain uh, effects, animated versions of magic games, and some sports. Actually, all of them are animated. Uh, Games which are interactive. Even the stories are interactive. You can ask them building confidence. Uh, and what you want, what I what I summarized that could be good for a good function of human being is uh, have a good uh, self confidence. Which I don't have right now. <laughs> um, do have uh, empathy, creativity, and uh, also self uh, That could really help. With that's it. Okay. Just, uh, so two, two things on, on uh, I, I'm going to criticize a little bit the pitch, and then I, I'm going to criticize the, um, okay, feedback, you know, criticize the, uh, the, 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 the business. Um, the, the first one on a, on a pitch, um, on, on slides, always make slides, you know, I think the, the, the person that has nailed it in, in, in the corporate environment is, is certainly Apple, right? Steve Jobs was a master of slides. And um, what, what usually works much better is, is using less words and more pictures that really uh, express something. The, the, the second thing I would always think about is tell a story, right? The, People will never invest on tons of facts that you know you, you're going through a bullet list. They want to tell a story, right? And they want to hear a story. And you should tell a story, right? So um, the, the the third point is in your first sentence um, you need to say what exactly you are, right? So your casual game for the kids market, or your casual game that tries to combine fun and entertain and, and education. Um, for, for kids or um, whatever it is, but, but be very precise from getting on what exactly you're trying to do. Um, sometimes it really works, you know, um, if you say, I am trip advisor for restaurants or I'm Amazon for <coughs> children growth or something like that. So take, take a really uh, a, note, a name that, that everybody knows and kind of say, I am X for Y, right? Sometimes it's simplified, but it, it puts everybody immediately into the, 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 the point of 
um, why is that important? Right? So I will lie to me for kids. For example. Yeah. Um, so that, that's on the, on, on the pitch. Just simplify, tell a story, why would people invest in you, what is the big thing about it, etc. Coming back to, to kind of the business, casual gaming is, I mean, it's, it's, it's a huge market and uh, I think there's, there's good monetization opportunities, etc. It's also very tough to kind of come up with a differentiation these days that still works, right? So, I would really think about what exactly differentiates you um, and what is the, the, the approach that nobody else does, right? Uh, so I think that I didn't really completely get that from, from the pitch, but that's what, something I would, I would think about. It's uh, emotional intelligence play. I don't see that uh, doing in games. I saw it uh, doing in a competitor which does it uh, by sending the uh, DVDs and, uh, yeah. and small books. Yeah. So you have to work with Yeah, fair enough. But just put that into the, the, the core of your pitch, right? If that is the, the single differentiator, that needs to be kind of the key element of, of the pitch. Actually, there are a lot of innovations that we create within the whole process. But yes, this okay. is a big one. Cool. Okay. Thank you. 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 Thank How much regulation is in uh, this learning market for kids? Excuse me? How much regulation? I mean, is there any or...? Not really. Okay. <laughs> because uh, actually, I think for example, Zoodles, uh, they, uh, they said all the blogs that they're going to, they're putting in uh, one of the... The first game played by the... The number one game played by the kids is... Uh, can you guess? Angry Birds. Angry Birds, Angry Birds yes. <laughs> So. I think the, the, the challenge in that area is always, in terms of people that are trying to link entertainment and, and education, right? Which, which generally is a really good idea. The, the challenge is really, who do you sell to? I mean, in the end, the parent has a credit card um, and, and needs to pay for it. The kids almost take the decision about, you know, these are the, the games that I really like. So it's, it's always that, you know, do you pitch do you pitch the education aspect to the, the person that pays in the end? Or do you pitch the really fun aspect to the kid? Um, so it's, it's a little tough what exactly you're pitching and who's paying for it. You have to combine uh, both of them. Actually, I have an example of... Uh, I've studied a little bit competition. And, uh, if you want to succeed, you have to do both of them. Yeah, you, have you have to make personal customer go with kids and uh, parents. So it's, uh, okay. Cool. Thank you. Great.